Hello, I am Aziz Shaybani. I'm a neuromuscular specialist from Houston, Texas. I'm going to talk today about the phenomenon of facilitation in neuromuscular medicine. Post exercise facilitation is a characteristic feature of Lambert Eaton syndrome. Simply, it means increased strength of the tested muscle and or enhanced deep tendon reflexes after sustained muscle contraction, in particular, after a brief period of rest. Pathophysiologically, this is caused by the presence of antibodies against the voltage-gated calcium channels in the presynaptic terminals. This is the channel that is blocked by the antibodies. Therefore, calcium will not influx to the terminal and acetylcholine is not released. Here's a video to demonstrate facilitation. Reward one, two, three. Reward one, two, three. Stronger, push up. Obviously, she gets stronger to demonstrate that the reflex are regained by exercise. So here, there's no reflex here. Go like this for me and keep it up. Relax. Good. There, right? After exercise. The video has demonstrated facilitation of the left patellar reflex after a brief exercise, and it demonstrated facilitation of the strength of the tested muscles after exercise. This is an important feature of postsynaptic neuromuscular transmission disorder. Post-exercise facilitation and an incremental response after high frequency stimulation, share the same mentioned pathophysiology. Usually, facilitation is noticed in several muscles and patients with limbs. The degree of facilitation is important diagnostically. If facilitation is noticed in one muscle greater than 400%, the patient almost certainly has limbs. Or, facilitation is greater than 100% in several tested muscles. However, facilitation more than 50% is only suggestive of limbs, and it can happen also in myasthenia gravis. A couple of studies have shown that the optimal duration of exercise is 10 seconds. Teachable moments are number one, check for clinical and electrical facilitation in all patients with myopathy. In particular, 
when the CMAP amps are diffusely low. Two, the optimal exercise is 10 seconds of sustained muscle contraction of the selected muscle. Thank you.